People in the UK are angry about housing, and they should be. It's in crisis. By 2020, first-time buyers will need to be earning over £60,000 a year. In London, average earners now spend over two-thirds of their income on rent. The problem is as much to do with inequality and the rise of the global super-rich as it is to do with house building. Houses are being used as piggy banks for the world's super-rich. Foreign investors now own close to 10% of the UK's housing stock. In prime central London, 28% of the buyers don't even live in the UK. With a limited supply of housing, there is less to go around for the rest of us, pulling up house prices and rents at every level so that those at the bottom, young people and those on low incomes have nowhere to go. But this isn't just a London thing. New developments in Manchester and Birmingham are increasingly advertised as investments for buyers overseas. We need to limit home ownership to UK residents. Only those that have been paying taxes in this country for two years, as well as the public sector, legitimate charities and companies domiciled in the UK should be able to buy residential property. This would help ease our chronic housing shortage and stop the global super rich from distorting our housing market. Countries like Switzerland, Australia and Denmark already have limits on where overseas buyers can invest. Why can't we?